Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Donna, a classical singer. Today I'm going to record Juliette's Je veux vivre aria from Gounod's Romeo Juliette. And before we start, I'm just saying some feedbacks about my last video where I sing Pamina Ach ich fühls. Well, I have to say that, um, yeah, Pamina is not an easy aria, <laughs> even if Mozart um, requires a simple way of uh, music, or I think it's nice to sing it simple with a big piano, so I think Pamina should be big, even if I tend to uh, make my voice smaller. We should all think of our own with the body doing the piano, actually. And um, since I'm singing Pamina, I learned it for auditions, actually, but I love it. Um, my voice changed, I think, two or three times, so I just realized I, I, I have to find another way to reach what I want in the aria. And without teacher, it's uh, quite hard. So because of that, I'm very satisfied with the, with the, um, with the video that made it my, made, I made it my own way, actually. And it's not that bad. Um, but even I talk about it all the time when I'm teaching or in my videos that prepare yourself <laughs> for every note. And I practiced it so much, the first note, and that And still these two beginnings were so, not tense, but yeah. <laughs> I should have just gained more confidence that I practiced it so much and I have it there, I prepare the room, but still, I think it's okay to have tension to build up, to just, for the concentration to begin. But then we should always remember ourselves to to be rounded, to to relax a bit. And I saw it on my video that some parts in some parts I remembered myself to just relax and it sounded much nicer. <laughs> um, but it's still hard because in Pamina your intonation has to be perfect. It's sometimes it's it sounds like exercises, warming up ex exercises, but but you have to be careful that the brightness of the high notes stays, so you don't sing every note where it is. So, for example, in the end, so im to, and you don't think, yeah, now it's a deep note, so im to, no, ro, you stay in this, im to, you're looking down from the highest floor, actually, and. Um, yeah, so I should have think. No, I think I should have sang it um, more with my body, but I'm still working on it. Maybe my device didn't record it that much, that good. Maybe I did that already. Um, and um, yeah, but I'm working on it. So that's all for me. And advice for you if you're learning Pamina. That um, yeah, the intonation then the pronunciation when you're already so start first without text just with vowel so you land on every note for example if it's an interval going downwards that you land stable record yourself if it's if you land a bit like this or the intonation is is, is a bit low or high then that means that your body is not your brain your body is not used to it yet where it's going and where it's going so Think of legato too. Pamina has <clears throat> a very naked accompaniment and there are these pauses. But of course, because Pamina just experienced something, <clears throat> sorry, <clears throat> that she doesn't find the words. And you know, when, when, when you have the feeling in your heart, in your head, but you just cannot express it with your voice. And that's why. But the music has a direction. Every note has a direction. Think of that. And um, I don't know if I said it. I think it's... Um, I love to sing Pamina. This is my last thought for it. Because I think it's so good if you're nervous, for example, to sing it with a clear mind. I think it's easier to sing it, to inhale 
the thought and the emotion before the of the phrase but then so you have the the color of the for the phrase but then you can clear your mind and just think of the flow and on technique technique so that's it and now i hope you enjoy my juliette <laughs> These commercials are sometimes we cannot just stop them. Sorry. So thank you very much. Um, I have to say it already as a feedback. This accompaniment is so um, fast for me. So sometimes, for example, at the end, I took uh, an extra breath because I had to swallow and I had I needed the time also to relax before we go to the last peak. And that's why I did that. Uh, so maybe it sounded a little bit hectic, but uh, still, I hope you enjoyed it and have a beautiful day.